Every one of us comes from a family. You have a family, I have a family, even tulips have families. Every tulip you see began as part of another tulip, a parent tulip. When the time is right, the new tulip material leaves its parent and sets off to become a flower all its own. There are two main ways that a new tulip bulb can be created. The first way is with seeds. Almost all flowering plants produce some kind of seed. It's one of the simplest ways to package their genetic material and send it out into the world. Seeds are created after a female flower has been pollinated with the pollen of a male flower. Once the seeds have been formed, the flower relies on wind, rain, or animals to help distribute them. A tulip seed can travel miles from its parent plant before settling in its new home. Once a seed has settled, it begins the long process of becoming a bulb. A tulip seed must become a bulb before it can grow into a flower. The process of a tulip seed transforming into a bulb can take up to five years. The second and speedier way for bulbs to be made is directly from other bulbs. Some tulip bulbs become what is known as a mother bulb. This mother bulb will begin to develop little bulblets along its base. If the tulip is healthy and gets enough energy, those bulblets will continue to grow until they're large enough to split away from their parent. Then, those little bulbs will slowly mature on their own until they're full size and ready to sprout into their very own tulip. So, the next time you see a group of tulips, take a picture. You may have just captured a multi-generational tulip family portrait.